Bradley pass complete to number 11, Charles Cornell. That, that big run you had, and um, just talk to me about when you got the ball and what you saw and how you busted through the hole for that long run. Well, it was on a counter play, so as soon as I saw the linebackers bite on the jet, I just saw open daylight and I wanted to break it for as far as I can go. To be honest, I thought I was going to get caught from behind, but I made it. Congratulations on the win. Uh, you guys didn't need McMahon too much. Obviously, a lot of people here thought he'd be the big-time player for you guys. Talk about talk a little bit about the uh, other players that stepped up. We had some today. seniors that really stepped in. I mean, Sebastian uh, Hernandez came in and played some solid defense, made some good tackles. Brian Eliason came in, made some great plays. Some y some young kids, but really Matt Nicolier took the lead and said, "Give me the ball and let's roll on defense." I mean, he took it. He made some great hits on Purnell. He made had a great touchdown run. I mean, you, you saw it's not the little th it's not the big plays always from Dylan McMahon, but if you watch that touchdown run. That Matt was about to get caught, and Dylan came in out of nowhere to make sure he made that block so he didn't get caught. So, I mean, it's the little things that are done by our seniors. Talk about being able to stop Purnell. Purnell really couldn't get going. I, I, I thought he'd have a, a, a better game, hey, but it, it looked like you guys were hitting him before he got going in the backfield. It Talk was about, about it was it was the old school smash mouth, run to the football, swarm to the defense, swarm, swarm, swarm to the ball. I mean, that's what it was. We still in their heads, fly to the football. Don't let him out. Don't let him escape. He's a fast back. He's an excellent back. When Nogi was coming back and they they uh, were about to tie the uh, tie the game, what? What was the feeling on the sideline? I mean, it was low, but we had everyone together, and we were trying to settle them down and relax, guys. I mean, it's okay. We still get the ball. We know how potent our offense can be. So we knew settle them down, relax. We're going to be all right. All right, last one. You guys have uh, got one big game out of the week. Talk about the one coming up next week over oh, in uh, over in Ansonia. Starting 20 minutes, it's all Ansonia time down here. I mean, it's a, it's it's a great game overall. It's a great rivalry game. They got a heck of a back at Arkell Newsom, and uh, they got some great players in Matos and McKnight. They, they they're a top 10 team in the state. They are without a doubt. So we got to have put our game plan together and get going.